Hey everyone, welcome back to another Thread Up Denim Rescue Box unboxing. My name is Lindsay and I'm a part-time reseller. Um, this is a 30 pound box and where did it come from? This box came from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania and I ordered it on St. Patrick's Day for 30% off. So I will put the total on the screen. And um, I've actually had this box sitting here for a long time, but I was sick for a few weeks, so um, I was not well enough to film videos. So now I'm super excited to open it because I want to get back to work. Hey you guys, I totally forgot to mention my shout out. Um, so I'm trying to do these shout outs in all of my videos going forward. And the person that I want to shout out today is Thrifty Native, Stephanie. Um, her channel is amazing. I love her bins thrift hauls. So definitely check her out. I've been watching her for a while. And she's a stay-at-home mom like me. So um, yeah, definitely check out her channel. You guys will love her bins hauls. All right, so let's get started. Before I open this box up, I... Um, I want to start like kind of like saying what's what brands I want in these boxes. Um, I would love to get some Rock Revival. Um, I've actually never sold it or found Rock Revival, so I would love to get that in this box. Um, obviously, I would love to get Mother Jeans. I've sold those before and a Goldie. Those do really well. Um, and then also, I'm hoping to get. I'm hoping to get at least 10 pieces to, to list. All right, so let's get started. Okay, so the first pair is this brand Days, which I've never heard of. There's another tag right here. These are size 26 and they are, they say that they're they're cotton and organic cotton. Okay, interesting. I'm not seeing a style in here, but they look like they are like a straight leg and they are distressed. So this is a brand that I'm gonna have to look up. I've never heard of it, but it does have the brand on the buttons and everything. So let me know if you guys know this brand. Okay, next is, oh, Good American. I have never sold this brand. I've never found this brand. Um, there seems to be some bleach spots on here, but um, they're, these are really cute. They're like a flare. They're in good condition other than those spots. So um, I'm gonna look these up and see how they do. These are a size 4 slash 27. If they do well, maybe I will do some type of bleach splatter on these. Unless this is just dried up soap, um, we'll see. But I, I'm excited to try out Good American. Okay, next is Old Navy and these are just a kid's pair of jeans. They're a size 12. And I don't know any kiddos at that size so um, I might have to just donate those. Okay next is a pair of overalls and these are YMI Girl. So these are like a junior's size. They're a skinny overall and let's see what size are these? 12. These are another 12 so Okay, those will probably get donated. Okay, next is Kendall and Kylie, uh, which I've never sold before, and I'm pretty sure it probably doesn't do that great. It is a size 9 slash 29, and they are a really cute pair. They look like they're like maybe a cropped straight. It says the Icon High Rise Straight. Maybe they are regular length, but they kind of look cropped. So... I don't know. I might try these on actually. Um, 
yeah, we'll see. I don't think that they'll resell though. I'll look them up. Okay, next um, is a pair of Levi's 511 Slim. These are definitely a kid's size. They're size eight regular. And this is my son's size. So I think I might hold on to these for him. Next is a pair of Old Navy Rockstar Super Skinny Jeggings Mid-Rise. And they're like a pull-on jean. And they look like they're in pretty good condition. They do have an elastic waist. These are, oh, they're size zero. I don't know if these would sell. So I'm, I don't like to really sell um, Old Navy in the smaller sizes, but I, I'll check it, I'll check this out. I'll look at the comps because these are in really good condition. Okay, next is, it looks like Gap. It's like faded. Uh, these are size 29, Resolution True Skinny High Rise. Um, there is a little bit of stretching in the crotch, so um, I probably won't list these. Okay, next is Westport Denim, size 4. I've never heard of this brand. It's probably nothing amazing. Um, but I will look it up. I have never heard of it before, so it's always nice to learn new brands. Next is Duchess Jeans, which is that, is that, what's her name? Fergie? Did Fergie have a clothesline? I don't know. I remember her album was Duchess. Um, these are very Y2K. They're very cute. They are flares, and the pockets are very Y2K. Um, I think I might... They, well, there is a little bit of... Yeah, that's a hole right there by the crotch. If, I, if that hole wasn't there, I would have listed these on Depop. But there is a hole, so I won't be listing those. Okay, next is a pair of Sun. They are shorts, and they are... A size 25. Here's the tag. And they are a really cute pair of shorts with daisies embroidered. These are really cute, so I'm probably going to list those. I probably won't get more than $10, $15 for those, but they are really cute and I want some shorts in my store. Okay, next is STS Blue Emma Ankle Skinny in size 30. Um, let's see. Oh, they have some cute little embroidered detail on the sides and a cute hem. So, um, and the crotch doesn't look too bad. There's not too much, there's no wear in the, in the middle or where the crotch and the butt are. Um, and this is what the brand tag says. So I've sold this brand before, not for very much. So I'm gonna look up the comps and see if this pair does well. Okay, next is Time and True size six high rise boot cut. They are just like a um, like a beige pair of jeans. And I, I'm seeing like a bleach spot right here. Maybe it's just a surface spot, I'm not sure, but um, it's just Walmart, so I won't list these, but because they're my size, I'm gonna try these on, because I do like the color. Okay, next is another pair of Old Navy Rockstar Super Skinny Jeggings. And these are kids, size 10. And they look like they're in pretty good condition. Um, size 10, I don't think my niece is a size 10 yet, but I might give these to her because they're in really good condition. Okay, next is another pair of Old Navy. These are a size 4, the Curvy OG Straight Secret Smooth Pockets. I think that's what it says, High Rise Curvy OG. Okay, 
Um, let's see. They feel like they're in good condition. It looks like there's a paint. No, that's not paint. That's coming off. Um, yeah, so I probably won't list these, but I might try them on. Sometimes I can fit into fours. They look like they're big, too, so I might try those on. Okay, next is a skirt, and it is Hollister, size 3. Just a cute little faded black mini skirt. Um, Hollister is very hit or miss for me, um, but I'll look up the comps on that because we're in the season for it, so I might list that. Okay, next is Hudson. These are size 26. I'm trying to think, have I ever sold Hudson before? I really don't think I have. These are in really good condition and they're cute and I like this gray color. Did I show the tag? That's the tag. Um, I will probably list these. I don't know how Hudson does anymore. I, I remember when I first started reselling, this brand was a really good brand to pick up. So I'll just look up the comps and see how it does. Next is Universal Thread. These are just Target. They're the boyfriend jean, size 0, 0.25. And yeah, because it's such a small size, I'm probably just going to donate these. Okay, next is a vest. Yeah, this is a Levi's vest, which I will probably list for sure. Um, I have never seen this tag for Levi's before. That's very interesting to me. Let me know if you guys know anything about this tag. It says it's a size medium, and that is my size. So I'm going to look up the comps and see um, how it does. But I actually might keep this for me because I want to, I've always wanted like a punk jacket or like a punk vest with like a bunch of patches on it. Um, so I might keep this for myself. I'm not sure yet. Okay, next is, it looks like an unbranded pair. It's a 2XL. Yeah, I'm not finding a brand on these. Huh. They're in good condition, but if they don't have a brand, it just says jeans on the button. So, yeah, I'm not, I'm not seeing a brand, so... These, I'm going to put them to the side and see if I can find a brand. If not, they'll probably just get donated. Okay, next is a pair of Express. And let's see. These are the Girlfriend High Rise Size 4. And they look like they're in pretty good condition. I don't really sell Express jeans, but... Um, I will look them up and see how they do. I actually used to love wearing Express jeans in the early 2000s. Um, so maybe, I don't know, I'll just look them up and see how they do. They're good quality. Next is a pair of Cut From The Cloth, which I like selling this brand. This is a size 20W, and it's the straight leg. Let's see the condition. There is some stretching in the crotch, so I probably won't sell these. Yeah, they're like, they're pretty worn. Let me see. Um, well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I will consider it. I'll look up the comps. Um, they don't look that bad, so this is a maybe piece. Okay, next is another jean jacket, and it is Levi's, and it looks old. This tag looks really old. So, let's see if we can find any information in here. The tag is really faded on the inside. It says made in the U.S., so... This might be a vintage piece. It looks very vintage. So 
Um, there is some discoloration around the neck, but I could oxyclean that. And either way, I will probably list this. I have done very well with Levi's jean jackets. All right, we're getting close to the bottom here. <clears throat> okay, next is uh, Earl Jeans Skinny. This looks like just some fast fashion brand. It's a size two. Here's the brand tag. And um, they're kind of blingy, but they are very cheap feeling. So um, I'm gonna look them up, but I just, I don't think that they're anything special. Alrighty, next we have a pair of Shein, size medium. Okay, let's see. They're just like a, they're like a wide leg, distressed, um, light wash pair of jeans. Uh, I'm not, I probably won't list these, but I mean, I can look up the comps and see, but since they're a medium, I'm going to try these on. So we'll see about those. Okay, next is a pair of silver jeans. And these are the Suki Slim Boot. And they are a size 28-31. And they're, I'm seeing, oh, that's just fuzz, I think. So they look like they're in pretty good condition. That's fuzz right there. So I will probably list these. I just sold two pairs of um, silver maternity jeans, so I will probably list those. Okay, next is D jeans, 14W. I don't know what D jeans are, but here is the tag. Um, let's see. There is a little bit of stretching. So I'm, it's not terrible. Yeah, it kind of is. Yeah, this one's probably gonna get donated. Okay, two more pairs, you guys. Uh, all right, so the first one is a Nua Tags Levi's 550. These are 27 by 27. Uh, the retail was $40. And yeah, I will definitely list these because they are Nua Tags. I actually really like selling Levi's. I've heard some people recently say they don't really like selling Levi's anymore because they're not doing as great, but that's actually, um, so Disney and Levi's are my top selling brands, so I'm excited to list Levi's. Okay, next is Free People. They're a size uh, 26. Does it have a style in here? Um, I'm not seeing a style, but, uh, yeah, they look like skinnies, and they definitely have a lot of stretching in the crotch, so I probably won't list these. Alright, that is everything in my box, and I can tell you right now, just from looking at my piles, my donate pile is a lot smaller than my listing pile, which is really good, and that doesn't usually happen. So I am very happy with this box. I have some brands that I can try out for the first time and some other brands that have done well for me. So I'm very happy with this box. Let me know what you guys think about everything, and let me know if you know any of the brands that I didn't know. Also, if you guys want to see any more of my content, I have some thread up box recap videos coming up and I have one travel vlog coming up this month. Um, so yeah, definitely subscribe if you guys wanna see more of my videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye.